to FSB now with the Bandit. Uh, this is week six as we're going to look take a look at the FSB Sportsman Truck Series at the Nashville Fairgrounds. Alrighty, here we are at the Nashville Fairgrounds and we got the green flag as the uh, Truck Series takes off on their uh, race six. Here's the 23 of Jason. Oh, number 13, Mark Knoll, gets into number 23, Jason Sutton, down the backstretch at the Nashville Fairgrounds. Here's a self-spin of the 74 of Tom Walker in the 74 truck as he spins around and loops it. Don't forget now, remember, listen to uh, FSB Racing Rewind with Cody Rose. Uh, weekly too. Uh, there goes another self spin of Tom Walker and here goes Jason Sutton into the wall. Got mixed up with the 97 truck of Ken Hill. Here's four wide racing coming down the straightaway in the 66. Uh, Doug Michaels gets caught up with the 75 of Raymond Glacier. And it looks like the 66 truck of uh, Doug Michaels uh, looks like it's done for the night. And here we go with the self spin, number 97, Ken Hill spinning out down the straightaway, bringing out the yellow flag once again. And uh, then here we go on the last lap with uh, Charles Stevens up front. And uh, this is going to be the last lap here that they're running here at Nashville Speedway. And uh, don't forget now, remember FSBRacing.com. Come visit that site. Awesome site. Come and join us. Race online. It's fun. We've got a bunch of clean racing guys here. All right. There's Charles Stevens winning the race. And here is the results for everyone to uh, take a look at. <clears throat> As we're going to head next to the Evergreen Speedway for the uh, Whaling Modified Series. As they're coming down for the green flag, and the green flag is out as they're going flying by us here at the camera view here. And as we go around, uh, here's a problem here. The 48 car of Jeff Brombach trying to make it into the pits and did not quite make it right. The 66 of Doug Michaels does a self-spin. And then the 78 got into the wall, came back down, got into the 27. And then the 519, the flying mailman, Pat Cross, gets into the 27 and uh, flips over. The 50 getting into the 27 in the corner. Another incident there at the Evergreen Speedway. And then the number 60 of Randy Davis, as he loses control of the car, uh, he ends up, ends up losing control and getting to the inside of the track. Bad place to be, oncoming traffic coming. Believe me, I was the one in the double zero car. I just barely missed him. Here's another cell spin with 97 Ken Hill uh, spinning out there in turn two. As here's an incident with myself. Got a little too close to the wall. Took out the engine on the car. Was done for the night. The double zero POW MIA Dodge. Uh, was doing very well in that race, but uh, ended up... Uh, Taking the motor out on it, got a little too close to the wall. All right, as we uh, see the double zero pulling in there on the inside, uh, there's the 25 car getting into the 99 car. It looked like a uh, connection issue there as they spin around on the in the corner there. And uh, 24, Charles Stevens is your winner. And here are the read results strolling up the screen. And in second was Yardborough, Josh Grove was third, fourth was Chris Cash, and and so on as, as it strolls up through. Uh, now we're going to the FSB Sportsman Cup Series that was run at uh, Watkins Glen this week. And as they're coming down for the green flag, as you can see, the uh, boss is up front there, Jim Ray, and uh, you got the 99 pops there in second place. As they're coming down towards turn one, Ed, the number 96 up front, and then you got Milt in second, and here they come around the corner. Okay, we got some shots here of cars going off the track. Myself, double zero, missing the corner. Going right off into the kitty litter. And number four, Paul McAllister, same way. Uh, it seems like we had a thing there happening there in that corner. 
Uh, as uh, we see the 66 of Doug Michaels uh, not breaking enough, getting into the back of the 92, and then the 78 of uh, Jerry there comes right in behind him, and they both end up in the kitty litter. The 92 of Chris Cash gets into the 48 of Jeff Brumbach. As they spin around there, everybody keeps on going. As we're coming down here to the finish, and up in the right-hand corner, you can see uh, how the race completed. Uh, Milt, the monster, in the zero car wins the race. And uh, also, you'll see the fastest laps up here, too. As they're having fun at the end, getting into the kitty litter. Milt, your winner in the zero car. And I also have the results up here, too, for you. As we continue on here... Uh, Give you time so that you can read those. <laughs> we don't want to bounce right into the next one without you being able not to read those. Okay, here we go. Going into the FSB Pro Cup Series. This race here was um, run at Watkins Glen. Uh, this is the Pro Cup Series running at the Glen. And here they come down for the green flag. As everybody's organized, here we go. Green flag is out. Flagman throwing the flag up. And you got Damien and the number 30 up in the front spot right now as uh, as they head down towards the S's here. Whoa, we got a little problem here. Whoa, the 23 gets into the 98. The 23 of Jason Sutton gets into the 98 of Bill Yardborough and had quite the crash there. There's the number 30 car winning the race, Damian Godzilla, as they all call him Godzilla here at uh, FSB. Alrighty, and there's your results from Watkins Glen from the Pro Cup race at FSB Racing. Alrighty, now we're going to uh, uh, have some of our uh, sponsors here come in and... Uh, show you some of those and then we're going to be going to uh part two of uh week six in the fsb racing series